there's a quote that I read or I heard, I can't remember, but it says, people who are always traveling are either running away from something or are trying to find something. And I am probably both type of people, if that makes sense. I am, yes, running away from something, but I am also trying to find something. However, I am also trying to broaden my horizon and explore the riches that the world has to offer. I've just realised it. Your Brit was born in, in England. You have a South African accent. I have a Nigerian who was born in Nigeria and I have a British accent. <laughs> that's we, we both are missed, that's the way they're literally an um, um, absolute chaotic mess. <laughs> Show the window. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Right, wide leg pants. I guess that just repeats, right? You don't have like one.
The light's gonna be better if I come from here. Yeah. <laughs> this looks better. Now do it. Feels like um, <laughs> I've barely said much in this vlog. Just making a mess. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm in Cape Town. I've been here before. It is nice to be back. First of all, I am so envious of my friends, Birds of Paradise. This is incredible. This is like goals. I want mine in my apartment to be this high. However, my ceiling's not this high, but yeah. Sorry, enough about that. Um, it's been a rough couple few months, you know, since October after, after my first surgery. And I just kind of needed a break. And, you know, I was talking to Dan, like, telling him about, like, he knows what's going on. You know, when you have, that's the one thing, you know, I would say is I'm very fortunate to have, I don't have that many friends, but the ones I do, 
are just the best, you know, and I can tell them everything, tell them how I'm feeling. I don't have to hide anything. I can be emotional, you know, it's not always the good times. And when I said to him, you know what, well, to be fair, like he realized I wasn't myself. You know, when you can tell that if you're close with someone that, you know, that they're not themselves and he was just like, why don't you take a break? And I was like, yeah, I need to take a break. And he lives in Cape Town. I've been to Cape Town before. I loved it. And, you know, one thing I won't take for granted is having people in my life that are willing to share my, their space with me. And I don't take that for granted. And I feel very lucky. And that's why I'm here. I had no purpose of how I was going to do this vlog. I just thought, you know what? I am going to take my time, not think about work, just film whatever I wanted to. That's kind of what I am doing here. I wanted this to be just chill. No stress about filming, no stress about content. Just have a nice relaxing time. So hence why if this vlog is somewhat disjointed. This was just coming here saying to that, look, I don't want to do any work. I don't want to do anything strenuous, just nice and chill. And I'll just go with the flow. So yeah, I appreciate my friends so much. That's the one thing I, I always tell them. And I think we should all do that, especially as guys. I think guys don't do this enough. Tell your friends you appreciate them because I am very, very lucky that the few friends I have, I can count on. And being here and back home and knowing the people that I, that care enough about me to always be there when I need them has just been a godsend. And it's just nice to also, I, Cape Town's beautiful. Don't get me wrong. There is some parts of it that's not great. There's some inequality, but being African and being here, there's such a connection. I absolutely love it. I feel at home. I don't feel like I'm on, uh, I'm on vacation. I don't feel like I'm on a holiday. I feel at peace. And London, I love London, but the last few months I just wasn't myself and people could tell. And being here has just been nice. Also the sun, sun makes such a big difference, right? So um, yeah, I don't know what to say. It's just nice being here and being around such a beautiful, beautiful place, beautiful country and taking you along the ride with me. So if you're just like this video, this vlog is, doesn't make any sense, yes, <laughs> because there's no structure to it. I want you to enjoy this as I am enjoying it. And um, yeah.
Whenever I travel, I like to be quite creative with my content and this time I asked my friend Dan, who is an incredible photographer, if we could somehow magically <laughs> make me look somewhat cool in pictures, but um, I didn't want the usual type of photography I normally would take. So hopefully you enjoy some of these because these were some of my favorites. Mm -hmm. 